do understand it's do or die. Like, there is no tomorrow. There's no retakes and redos. If you guys screw this up and aren't ready to go Friday night, there is no next Friday. up on the board uh, and the week agenda is up there so you know what we're doing this week. The only thing really different is we'll be uh, a little bit more contact today in practice than a normal Monday. Uh, no recovery run today but uh, we will uh, practice a lot of team uh, team stuff today. We still got to get better at uh, adjusting. Coach is going to talk about some defensive adjustments that we need to get, uh, get into quicker uh, and then uh, offensively we just got to get better at what we do uh, we're not going to add in a bunch of different stuff. We've got two pages full of, uh, of plays we can run, and we're getting better and better at running all of them, uh, and that's what we've got to continue to do. All right, so uh, we will sub stuff and have scenarios. Where we'll sub people and, and do some stuff like that this week. So when your number's called, be ready to go. We're going to go Storm and Reed will be the two primary defenses. I went through and did an audit of all their formations with their plays and they're down in distances, okay? So if you want to look at that, you can, and when they prefer to run it. It's going to be hitches, or it's going to be the two outside guys running bursts and the two slots running out. That's the combination where I think in read, we can get a pick six. If I had to compare this team to any other Windsor teams, I would say, very similar to 2019 ball club that went 10 and 3 and uh, upset Adrian District Championship game because of, I'd say the style of play is very similar, but the grit, but kind of the blue collar camaraderie the kids all have together. Like go to work, function as a unit, and uh, camaraderie among the coaches. Very, very similar to that 2019 program. Uh, Hayden moved over for when they try to kick a big boy, it's not going to work. And cause problems. Well, and that's fine. Okay. And that's something you guys will be able to do on the on the field the weekend. Work. I think we'll be better with their kicking hate and not me. The thing is, I think the center we can rattle enough. Danny, uh, acting up out there. Guys, practices aren't going to be that long, but we got to get work done when we're out there. You do understand it's do or die. Like, there is no tomorrow. There's no retakes and redos. If you guys screw this up, and are ready to go Friday night. There is no next Friday. I'm uh, Coach Spear, uh, the head football coach here at Windsor. And um, my background in, in football, I played high school in Junction City, Kansas, across the border. Um, played a little bit in college and bounced around. Ended up finishing college at Kansas State and working in the football department at Kansas State my senior year. So this group we, we've got this year is an interesting group. Uh, when we started uh, the season, we had 23 guys out. I think we're up to 26. Um, they, uh, they're a pretty tight-knit group. Uh, they were, the younger guys were really good in JV last year, and, and the uh, older guys had a, a big roles last year. Um, but our, our biggest thing is they take care of each other and, and uh, try to push each other in the right direction. Um, the leadership on the team is, is pretty good. We need to get a big game of murder mystery. Guys. Hey, nobody's going in the water today. Okay, good. Let's go, let's go. So what I think about being a quarterback that's so special about our team is the bond that we have for a younger football team. I think that takes us a long way in this district run. And uh, everyone doing their job as a collective unit, I think, is going to be the biggest part to success for us. Focus up. Focus up. Let's go. Big week, all right? Stay focused. Let's we'll continue bear. to get better. Don't bear. <laughs> hey, it's win or go home this week. As an upperclassman, it's kind of our duty and to keep everybody in check and keep everybody's energy up and not hang their heads with a bad practice or just to make sure everybody has good practice so we can play better on Friday night. We want the ball! 
more. Listen. We want the more. Directly over where your name plate is on your jersey. Okay. So everybody watch Aiden. Okay, good. Get down. Group can go right here. Okay. Group right here. Right here. Group. Hit. Oh. Good. Okay, <laughs> just drive out. Hold it. Now listen. Okay. Hold a drink when I say hit, drop it, catch it. Hit! Quick hands. Don't let it touch. Hit! Hey, you better drop it. Drop it, guys. Hit! Good. Good. Catch. Hands in. Here we go. Hit! Good. Sweet pop boom. I want to be a leader, but they don't want to act right. Hold on. Guys, don't go. You know, this summer when we first got this group together and we went to uh, Carrollton to do a, a big jamboree um, with a bunch of schools in the summer, and um, it was funny. I noticed something special about them going up there. Uh, we didn't have a bunch of kids, but all of them were laughing and joking and have a good time with each other in the back of the bus. And sometimes that, that gets on my nerves that they're not focused, but the, these kids, they all love each other and they, they have fun and, and like being around each other. Um, so, you know, and when it's time to focus and get to the field and we, we got warmed up and ready to go, they, they flipped a switch and, um, you know, to turn into football players all of a sudden, but they're still all just good friends. Okay, ready? Hit! Good! Hit! Good! 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 We're gonna be in Reed. 15, so, Reed, when you come up, okay, you're just basically locked on the back of the back. If you see H orbit, guys, if we see H orbit, your thought becomes <coughs> they're gonna run Rocket, I'm sorry, Toledo, or option towards you or Indiana. Okay, so you see H orbit defensive yeah. end? You guys are thinking Indiana, you guys are looking at Seattle Longhorn. Okay, you're watching as soon as you see that orbit, you've got to buy him. Indiana, right? If you see him pull, you gotta attack. Okay? If he doesn't pull, you're thinking Indiana. Got it. Bitch! You're missing it. And then outside there you go, outside in, inside out here. Okay, good. You're taking the F back out in the front. So, if we're in the, we're still doing the, we're going to say anybody else. The biggest way I keep people on in control on the football field is, uh, you know, we all just, we all got to talk about our assignments, alignments, stuff like that, like our coaches always say. Uh, another big thing is in the huddle, repeating plays twice to the guys so they can hear up front. And as a, being a younger quarterback, to get that message across to the older guys, you know, you're all there to do one job. So, regardless of your age, uh, anything like that, all those guys are there to win football games, and if you act like you care and put in the effort, then you're all in football games, and that's how you keep control of the quarterback on the field. If he's going to pull the kick, uh, right here, he's going here, going here. <laughs> right behind him. Once we pull, kill him on the edge. We'll absolutely have them for me. Good, good, John, bro. Me? Leading up to the first the they game. Can get it. They can pick it up and advance it. So do not quit on that. Make sure we recover the ball. Okay, yes, real quick. Time, it's going to be double face on four and ten. Okay, if one of those two aren't in, we go three. Yep, just regular dime. So dime defense. What? Good. All right, good. You got to reach for the over there. Go, go, go. Good. Yeah. Uh, hit. <laughs> go, let's go. Yeah, if he, uh, yeah, if he goes yeah, right at you, you leave my shot. block him out. Hit. Good. Nice shot. Nice shot. Run it. Got a back. Carter, watch. Carter, watch. Run it. Yeah. Oh, work. I shortened it. Practice. Yes, sir. Uh, clean it up. Guys, I know we're getting, it's getting old. Two weeks of practice with no game. Hitting the same people. We get tired of it. But we're still going to find a way to get better. You hear me? Find a way to get better. All right? Uh, we can't come out here and just go through the motions and wait for a time. Find a way. 
something you can work on every day, right? Right, Parker? All right. I'll it's make you yeah. do it. Let's go. Hey. Call it up. Nice. Hold close. Stay focused. Let's go quick. Hey, how's on three? One, two, three. We're gonna dine face on number four and number 10. Okay. Okay. If they come out, we're gonna face on four and 10 and dine. A face on number four and number 10, no matter what their formation is. Okay. If we're going, if we're going at uh, dime. And then, so doles, vert out mm -hmm. vert. Mm -hmm. And then hitches on first down. Yep. And then pro ring, pro wing, Seahawk first down, Indiana. And then Washington wall. Hey, fresh cut. Fresh cut. But Chase, I guess like they had like. Let's go! Move around! About to wake up! Contact, contact. Contact, are you ready? Cool. Keeps me motivated is winning the championship my senior year. Ready! You got you! Yeah! Go Team is we, we come out hitting like during game during practice anytime we come out swinging we hit each other hard we make each other better for Friday uh, when we come out there on Friday night we're just a family and nothing can really break us apart we get down on each other but we bring each other up and we're a family at the end of the day <laughs> he said he's going for a ride no sir <laughs> Oh, we never touched! Indo D, Indo D! Oh, outside linebackers, DBs down here! All the rest of y'all over there! Hey, we got Skelly. Kickers in the end zone! Yes, sir! Here, ball me. Dude, we're lining up like this. We're lining up like this. Consistency is the main focus of the DBs. Um, I feel like it's the strength of our defense, our DB unit. And so, whenever they're consistent, the rest of the team is consistent. Let's say... We're in our offense, right? Yep. They're in a 4-3. We don't have to worry about the new center, but they line up in a 1-3-5-7 as a 4, four front. Okay, the S is the force, right? The 7 is the plug. C over here is the secondary force. Yes, you can go okay. that way, or you can, you can go up and you can go back. You don't want a guy alley and secondary uh, contain. Somebody's got to cover the halfback pass. Okay, all right, so those can switch. You can have the C as the, uh, you do the force. Right. Yeah. Hey, you got it, let's go. <laughs> what are we in right here? Give him a look. Tighten. Good. Come on! Demons in charge! Drop your hips! Go! Go, Big Will! Go, Big Will! In out. Pop, pop, pop. Get ready, go! Not there, Cole. Ah! You're still out there. Oh, my bad. Um, I would say run. Run the ball like we have been, stay healthy the rest of the year. We gotta have good weeks at practice and keep the leadership going. Everybody's gotta stay mentally sharp and we gotta watch more film. We can make we can make a pretty long run into the playoffs. Hey, it's just speed option your way. Hey, what were you in? Uh, running through the plays against the scout team. Our scout team is pretty good. We got 
our starting linebacker play scout team so he gives us a good look and our D line's pretty quick and then we have some pretty big kids that sit out there and they give us a good look and push push the varsity O a lot harder than what I feel most other scout teams do for for the other teams. Why you put his hands on? Fourth and twenty, pump return. Pump return. Yes, pump return. I'm on time. It's cold. We hurt. Thank you. But we out here. It's cold. Really cold. Like really cold. But it's all right. We still out here working. Get that work in. Trick or treat time, my Come on, what the heck? Run it, run it, get on, go! Get on the go! Hey, way to recover! Hey, watch that dick. Big dumb tonight. It was a miserable practice. We got through it. It's going to warm up tomorrow. Tomorrow will be a warmer day. We'll get more work done. But good job uh, executing what we did out here. Nobody got hurt. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> All right. Hey. All right. We good? Hey, you guys watch film. Do what you're supposed to do in the classroom. Do what you're supposed to do in the classroom. All right. Call it up and get out of here. Hey, winner, go home. Yeah. Stay focused so, rest of the week. Three. Great practice today. Great practice. Keep it up. Rest of the week. Win or go home. Family on three. One, two, three. Family. All right. Uh, you know, preparing for with a bye week for a team that you already know. Both of us know we were going to play each other and we had two weeks to prepare. The first week we kind of... Uh, Still practice it, wanted to keep on schedule, uh, keep our routine uh, the same. We try to be very routine and, and the kids know what we're doing. So we practice Monday through Thursday that first week on just our stuff, trying to get better at we do what we do. We did watch a little bit of film on them. Uh, and then this week was just uh, a little bit easier because we had gotten the prep work done the week before so we really didn't have to spend all day Monday um, getting the prep work and the scouting report together. Um, we had that done uh, so we could jump right into scheming a little bit. Um, but uh, you know, we, as far as the schedule of everything, we try to stay as consistent as possible so the kids know what's going on and they can react better. Main focus this week on as a defensive player is to uh, just stop the wing T format and just keep the ball out of number three's hands. Uh, as a D end, uh, my job for the week is to stop the option and to squeeze down whenever they want to pull and kick the opposite side end, and just uh, beat the quarterback up on the uh, long passing downs and. Just keep the quarterback in the pocket for the week. All right, run your feet, guys. Ready? <laughs> Work. Move your feet. Go, Pop. Ready? Ready? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Coach Spear and his coach staff done a tremendous job with our kids. Um, kids seem to love to play for him. Uh, they're very disciplined. I've watched them play a few times this year. They're very disciplined at what they do. Uh, you can tell that they execute extremely well, which gives credit to the coaching staff on how well they have uh, their, their kids prepared for football games and, and the preparation that they put into getting their kids prepared. So what the program has done for the community in recent years, you know, it, it started back in, in 19, uh, won the district championship in 19, kind of out of nowhere and kind of unexpected. Went over to Adrian and... Uh, being a very good Adrian team, we kind of got the ball rolling, you know. 
it was it was great to see how the community come behind the football program at that point in time, and you could see the momentum uh, building in 2020 when we won a state title and carried on to 21 with another district championship. And Coach Spear changing coaches there between uh, 20, 21 and 22. Coach Spear coming in and implementing his offense and. And, and doing what he's done has kept the ball rolling and you can see the support that uh, our community has for our football program. Uh, when, when you win, it's, it's easy to get support and uh, our football program's done a very good job of, of gaining that support by continuing to win football games. Um, you know, they, they've had two pretty successful seasons under Coach Spear since we've had a, a coaching change. And, uh, when the football program, I always like to say that when the football program is successful, it, it, it builds a lot of momentum in the boys' side for athletics, and you can see that transfer into basketball and baseball. And I've been fortunate to receive some of that support, too, that the football program has, has, has garnered through the years from their success. Squeeze it down. Good, sweet. Good job. Good job. <laughs> hey, don't. Squeeze it. Good job, good job. Good job, good job Chase. On, All right, ready? Hey, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Contain the outside. Take away the middle. There we go. Well, you know, uh, home field advantage uh, definitely is different in the playoffs and regular season. Um, sometimes I'm not a huge fan of home uh, field games because of being the AD and everything else, the amount of work that goes into it. Uh, usually those weeks on home field games, I can't wait till 7 o'clock Friday night where I can do what, what I love to do and, and all the rest of the work is done uh, as far as painting the field and getting everybody here and, and the ticket booth and all that stuff. But I feel like our kids respond better to our home field fans. Um, you know, sometimes we worry about them losing focus with all of the stuff going on around them. Uh, when we go on the road, we get a, you know, an hour, hour and a half on the bus to focus in. Here, I, I bring them back at 4:45. Uh, they're back in the field house. We walk the field just like it's a regular routine, not like an away game. And that kind of is the trigger when we walk the field as a team. And, and uh, it, that's when it becomes game time to them. They really lock in. Down! Say, hit! Oh, oh, look. Oh. Oh. We got switch. Oh, you want switch? Yes. Switch route. Switch, 12 back to 10 on the outside. Quarterbacks are throwing it at your hips. Have your hands ready. Is it? Go get that ball, boy. There we go. Go and I got your nose. Fade over here. It was Aaron. Oh, I think Aaron made it. Sideline. Home field, they'll get to choose. All right, so they'll choose. Uh, remember, if they say defer, all we do is want the ball. We want the ball. all you're allowed to say. We want the ball. We want the ball. So um, we'll say they flipped and lost. Who wants to be the speaking captain? You? Yeah. We always want the win early. Now, we're not going to give up the ball, but let's say they took the ball. We want the win going back early because the wind dies as the night goes on. So the earlier we can win, the better the second half of my Kick return on that side. Kick return on that side. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, we see. Pro week. Okay, you guys have to think Indiana. Okay, if they go H orbit, you're still thinking Indiana. You're thinking Rocket or Toledo. Sorry, Toledo. Same with you. Okay. All right. So. Guys, their propensity on first down is to run Seahawk or Longhorn. 
I like defense the most is so I can pick apart our offense and make it a little bit better. I think I like defense the most is getting to shoot the gaps and destroy the opponent's offense. And once it comes to game time, you get more focused in. And our defense is a really key thing to our team. Is I think we all work together really well. And that really what brings us together. Hey, that's what it's about. Hey, it's 11 defensive players making one defense. All right, so make sure we're focused on all of that. Does anybody have any questions on anything they do? So they shift from wing T to empty. We're just going to storm it. Hit. Don't leave too early, bro. Yeah, Here we go. Ready, set. Yeah, I know. Down. That hit. Time. It's almost game time. Right here, this field. 7 p.m. tomorrow night with my boy Spoon. We finna tear it up, bro. We finna tear, tear it up. up. Pull out. Hey, Windsor, just, Missouri. Just Seven o'clock. I mean, that goes for tomorrow, guys. It's time to focus up. All right, we've had two weeks off. We haven't been on this field, and we haven't been on this field for like three weeks. Yeah. So it's time to focus up, get to school on time, be at school, act right in class. All right, we're gonna have to have some lessons on how to talk to teachers too. Act right in class, be respectful. Guys, it's game day. I don't need to be called to the office. All right, you guys are screwing, you're not just screwing up on yourself, it's the whole team. Guys, don't, hey, I'm just, there's no tomorrows, right? We talked about it last week. There's none. You gotta win. You gotta win. You gotta prove it Friday night. I don't care what their record is and what ours is. You gotta prove it Friday night. All right? Guys, tomorrow morning when you come to school, your behavior from the time you eat breakfast around people in our community to the time you arrive at school, you know, your behavior, the way you hold yourself, the way you walk down the hall, that tells everybody it's a big day. Okay, it's an exciting day. Okay, our, not just you, but our whole community is on display tomorrow night at seven o'clock. There's a lot of schools that aren't playing football anymore, guys. Okay, you gotta go out there and take it because when you wake up in the morning, nothing's gonna be given to us. Okay, we've gotta go out there as a team and take it. Send them to basketball. Yep. Send them, them to basketball. Let them go play. And be at breakfast. All right, let's go. Hounds on three. One, two, three, hounds. I'm really focused and I'm just really hoping we can come out strong and aggressive during the first half because that'll set the tone and then the second half just finish and do our job. Out of my whole high school career I'd say this is the earliest we've had a home playoff game and it means a lot to me because we have our home crowd out here and it gives us a chance to pop off and if we win this Friday we have another chance of hosting another home game. Uh, I think the big keys tonight playing West play is it looks like a team that has good speed. Uh, they're very fundamental on offense. They run some wing tee principles, which are always really difficult for a defense. And then they've also got uh, some spread formations that they'll throw out there. So you've got to be very diligent in your approach to a game plan when you play a team like that. Um, Sometimes offenses like that will kind of take a shotgun approach to a game and they will go through and they'll try to find a nugget, something that they can exploit on your defense. And you've got to be really, really careful with the adjustments you make throughout the game to make sure they're efficient and make sure that, that what you're doing on defense is you know, judicious enough that you're going to be able to minimize the effect they can have on you and then hopefully they won't exploit something before you can fix it and redirect and reallocate players to where they need to be and leverage positions and alignment. But I got a good feeling about tonight. Uh, I think the boys have done a tremendous job in the last week as far as preparation, game planning. Uh, we've got a very, very physical 
group of players, a very intelligent group of players. And I think if we play well, you know, focus on our alignment, focus on our communication, and leverage the ball, I think we'll be in a, in a good situation. But at the end of the night, it's it's a lot of minimizing their positives and trying to maximize on their negative plays and any turnovers that they might have throughout the game. Begin tonight. This is it right here. Have fun. This is playoff football. Yeah, boys. yeah, it's it's, 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 it's win. Yeah, we it's start we start the run now. It's not that. Let's right run all the way to state. Let's go. It's a home game. We gotta game win this game. one first. Let's fuck out on three. One, two, three, seven. Game time. Playoffs. Greyhound Nation gonna come out and support. We're turned for this. So let's go. Yeah. Jump in, jump in, jump in. Them boys up to something. They just spent like two or three weeks out the country. Them boys up to something. They just not just bluffing. You don't have to call. I hear my dance like Usher. Ooh. I just found my tempo like on DJ Mustard, woo! I hit that Ginobili with my left hand on like, woo! Lobster and Celine for all my babies that I miss! Hey, listen, you know, playoff time is a different deal, man. This this bye week kind of sucks doing the bye week right before because we all get jittery, we all get antsy, we get bored of practice and hitting the same guys. But guys, this is the second season. You've heard me say it. Second season, each team is zero and zero. When you go out there at seven o'clock tonight, you figure it out. It doesn't matter if we're ranked higher than them, they're ranked higher, I don't care. It doesn't matter. Here's, here's what pisses me off. If you want a little chip, besides them walking through our warm-ups, you want a little chip on your shoulder tonight? I've gotten interviewed about three different times this week going into the playoffs. And you know what they keep telling me? You guys have overachieved. Can you believe this team is overachieved? You know what that tells me? That pisses me off that they think that you guys couldn't do anything come in the year. And they have no idea what happens in this locker room and on that practice field every day. Potential is bull crap. We talk about potential before now. Potential is bull crap before the season because they have no idea when you love each other and work your ass off what, what you get. You understand? All of that, 11 weeks of it, probably three more before that, in the summer, it all pays off tonight. You understand that? Start the second season. You start the second season with an explosion. You go out there and beat the ever-loving crap out of this team that drove three hours to play you. You understand that? Yes, sir. Guys, you're ready. You've got everything you need. You've been coached all year to get it. Go get it. It's on you right now, right now. Go get it. We good? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. Lord, I'd like to thank you this night. Couldn't ask for better weather, really, honestly. It's a beautiful night. We've got everything that we need to be able to win tonight, Lord. We've been coached all week. We've been coached all year. The only thing I can ask out of you, Lord, is clear my brother's minds. Let everybody have clear minds tonight while we pray, while we play. Please protect my brothers, protect the other team. Ask for good officiating. We know we have good coaching, Lord. Please send us home with a W tonight. Amen. 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 This is it. Just like Coach said, they were talking about, oh, we overachieved, we overachieved. They ain't seen nothing yet, all right? This is just our playoffs. Hey, we did great this season, but it ain't over. Just like you were saying, second season, this is it right here. Let's go out there, let's smack them right in the mouth, and let them turn over dead. Because they will. First quarter, go out there, smack them in the mouth! Let's go! Yes, sir, come on, baby! Right? One, two, three! One, two, three! Sportsmanship, make, make sure we maintain good sportsmanship on and off the field, all right? If you have an issue with somebody, tell us, let us handle it. Don't try to do it yourself, okay? Equipment-wise, make sure all your equipment's 
properly snapped up helmets, mouthpieces in during a play, knee pads below, uh, over the knees. Okay, here's the point, guys. This is heads, this is tails. If I drop it off, flip it again. Heads was called, it is heads. You want to kick receive? Okay, you want to receive. Which goal do you want to defend? Uh, okay, go ahead and put your back to that goal. Put your back to this goal. Get your hands ready to go. Yeah, okay. Hey, hey, Parker. Eyes up. We're we're here, and if I say switch or I'll say red or black, if I see something, okay. Absolutely. Right, and, and, and hey, I'll just go like this and I'll away. Or I'll you easier. I'll go with here. That's away. Okay. All right. Got guys, get to your coverage zones, okay? Get to your coverage zone. Hey, let's go. Knock the ball down. Go it down. Face four, face ten. Hey, listen, up hey, front, guys. We're gonna be the lineup and those guys. We gotta strike so down hard into the beat. Hey, okay, listen, no, you're fine. Listen to me. You can look down. back and the guys want to keep going. Okay, you guys want to keep going. We're gonna have to go. Yeah, we're gonna have to go. Yeah, we're gonna have to go. Yeah, we're gonna have to go. Okay, we're gonna have to go. I mean, he came straight at him. That's his hey, fault. Hey, I can't run around with my eyes yeah. closed and call a penalty every time. <laughs> it's okay. No way! No way! We're good, Connor. Crack hey, it up. Coach, we're good. We're good, guys. Yes, yeah, come on. Hey, we're good. Come on. We're good. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, yeah. We're good. It's okay, Winter. Good night. Blow. We're good. He took, he took that one. Let's go. Get ready. Ready. Let's go, boys. Hey, hey. <laughs> it's a post. It's a post. Oh, 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 Push hard and go. Yeah, yeah. You, you got Hey, don't, don't go slow. No, it was good. You were 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 good. You
Hey, let's go. Hey, we gotta get three. Let's get three right here, guys. Hey, hey, block inside gap first. Inside gap first. All right. Let's go. All right. Yes, I don't boy. They tend to turn over the ball. We got to keep doing that. We cannot. We cannot. It seems better than we thought they would be. Am I right? Yes, sir. They're better up front. They're physical. Mm -hmm. But if we come, we get the ball first. If we can come out and pound their head first drive, it could be over because they're not going to like it. They're going to want to load the bus. All right. So we have got to establish that offensive line, defensive line. Keep pounding them. Keep pounding them. This is our kind of football. It isn't theirs. This is our kind. We establish it. We're good. Okay. Hey, coach, you got defensive adjustments? Yeah. <laughs> All right. If we want to go, you hear Alex Jones why, okay? I really would like us to be here, okay? <laughs> okay? Because he wants for a slant, he has run in the corner. A slant out, okay? Slant corner, he's going to run it right back to you. And then right over here, okay? Come on, come on. Let's go, boys. Come on. <laughs> Prove it all. It's not going to be. Shorty a goodie, my cousins are crazy, my cousins like boogie. Life is amazing, it is what it should be. Been here for ten, but I feel like a rookie. I tell her look up, cause it's snowing in tussies. But for three years, man, you can't even book me. It's me and little baby, the going crazy. Weezy produced it, and Weezy have made me. And she held it down, so she got a Mercedes. Your money records, the army, the navy. It ran me ten thousand, I threw it like Brady. The foreign is yellow, like Tracy and Katie. I trust in my they never betray me. Met all these they sweeter than Sadie. When I started out, I just took what they gave me. I told you it happened. I told you. Hey, listen, you, hey, great job. Hey, playoff games are hard to win. You guys, it was physical. It was tough up front. The scoreboard didn't show it, but it was. All right? Hey, playoff games are hard. It takes every single one of us. Hey, that thing about potential and overachieving, they have no idea what we can do when we work together and play together. No idea. Yes, All right? Hey, one more week. All right? Basketballs are bouncing in West Platte. <laughs> <laughs> Week. One more week, we continue to win. Hey, hey, but listen, smash up that preparation. We had two weeks to get ready. We only got like four days to get ready. All right. So Monday, 3:30, be ready to go. Hey, and listen, we're gonna need more film work out of you guys. Come next week, because whoever we're playing, all right, you gotta study them up. And we got two days of hard practice to prepare, and then a cleanup day, and that's really it. Okay. So we gotta be able to prepare and go. Hey, proud of you guys. Be proud of what you did for our, this town tonight. All right. And do it again next week too. That's right. Okay. Damn right. We'll be right here next week. All right. Yeah. Hello, Marcus. Right here. Hey. Let them hear it. Let them hear it. Everybody's looking.
looking at me now. Like, who's that shit that's rocking shit? Don't put it on the ground. Oh, fun. So hard with my girls on around me. There's definitely not an attitude. The camera's out. <laughs> <laughs> to keep everybody in check and keep them keep their energy up high. No, I could not. No, dude, how are you? Wow. Yeah, give me some questions, Coach McKnight. Uh, so what do you see yourself in five years? Mm -hmm. And I've got a potential plan already laid out for you to like to hear. <laughs> I think I know what it includes. Um, you're not going to talk about Spear though, right? <laughs> I plan on sitting right there in five years. Would, would I still be able to be here? Oh, wow! Oh, that was a long you have to give me, You have to give me a second to think about it. <laughs> Come out. We're going to face on four standard dogs. Oh, what? <laughs> 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 Go, work, work. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>